Hello, welcome to video three, Purple Tree Labs. Today we want to demonstrate Milo. He's a new module we've been working on for the Libby framework. Uh, the two major differences is one, he's got a man's voice, and two, he has a local MySQL connection to himself. So we wrote some code that'll go out to the Wikipedia, it'll go out to different blogs and different links, follow them and pull down the data the best it can and sort it into categories. So later when he's prompted vocally, he'll return vocal answers to them. Um, so we're going to demonstrate him, and we're going to do that by just uh, speaking his name, or first saying, Milo, start. Hello, I am Milo. My database was last updated 24 minutes ago from data on wikipedia.org. How can I help you today? Milo, search. Please tell me a category you wish to search around in. My categories are technology, science, the arts, history, or null category. Please say category followed by a category name. Category history. Category history, is that correct? Yes. Okay, category saved. What do you wish to search for in history? When was World War II? Please wait. World War II, or the Second World War, the start of the war, is generally held to be in September 1939 with the German invasion of Poland and subsequent declarations of war on Nazi Germany by the United Kingdom, France and the British Dominions. Four, five, many belligerents answered the war before or after this date, during a period which spanned from 1937 to 1941, as a result of other events. Amongst these main events are the Marco Polo Bridge incident, the start of Operation Barbarossa, and the attack on Pearl Harbor and British and Dutch colonies in Southeast Asia. Source, Wikipedia. Should I disregard this table? No, keep table. So that was a basic demonstration of uh, Milo. And uh, as you can see, the data pull is much faster. And um, he doesn't always get it right. He told us a lot more than we needed to know. We just wanted to know when World War II was. And in return, he told us all about things we, we really didn't ask specifically for. But in the end, you get the gist of it. And um, next, we're going to do some brightness tracking using the processing uh, framework. So when we walk into a room and the brightness changes, Libby or Milo can automatically start speaking to us rather than us having to prompt them. Thank you.